All right, all right, everybody. Today we are going to be starting our navigating the interface series. So I'm just going to be going over what are we looking at. Um, so let's start at the top left and bottom right. So these are both the My Info tab. They both take you to the exact same place. Um, so you can use them interchangeably. Uh, next over we have our VIP tab, which will just let you know where you are on VIP and what boosts you're getting. Next over we have our prosperity tab, which lets you know your prosperity and what boosts you're getting. Next over we have our gold, which if you click on it will take you to the shop to buy more gold. And then we have our AOZ coins, which again will take you to the shop to buy more AOZ coins. Um, coming down, we've got our building queue, building queue one, building queue two. Um, if you click on these, it will take you to your current building that you're building. Let me go ahead and start one here so we can show that off. Um, if you click on your power level, it'll take you to your strength analysis screen. If we move over here to the right, we have all of our shop screens. Uh, eventually the bonus pack and the newbie pack will go away if you're on experienced accounts, but your specials and your present box will always be here. Um, inside specials is where you get your good deals. Um, Usually there's a limited time deal right there, but we don't have one right now. Inside your present box are all of the kind of more basic, not specials. Um, we don't recommend buying from here, buy the specials. Underneath your present, you'll have some of the different quests that go on. Um, this should be your Road of Legends operations. Uh, so you can click in here and collect all your gifts. Underneath here, this is your um, new account kind of guide. And here's your uh, strongest commander uh, countdown timer. On the left here, you'll have Ginger, who at the beginning of the game just shows you all your new buildings and then she goes away. This is your event screen which shows you all of your current and upcoming events. Underneath that we have, uh, this isn't always here, again this is one of those uh, new account things that gives you some bonuses. And your doomsday recovery plan will not always be here. Once you finish that, it'll go as well. So usually you just have the uh, event button right here. On the right here, you'll have um, your commander skills, which is always here. And then sometimes you'll get another button for one of your daily events. Right now we've got giant cannon defense going on, so he has a shortcut right there. Uh, here is our chat screen, so if we click on chat, it will expand it. This will just be your nation chat, which you can browse and type to your teammates on. It just um, added emoticons, so you can place a little emoji guy there. Uh, on nation chat, you can scroll through nation and see what everybody's posting. Of course, there's some hot topics, if you're following any topics, and then things that you've posted. Um, down here at the bottom, we have, let's go right to left. So again, we've got our My Info screen. To the left of that, we have our Alliance screen. To the left of that, we've got our Mail screen, our Bag, our Quests. And the last one here is our Map. So when we click our Map, it'll take us over to the City View. Uh, differences here are on the bottom right, you've got your finder. Um, your finder brings up different level mines and monsters, so you can just go ahead and find one. You don't have to actually go searching the map for them, which is very convenient. Uh, if you exit out of that, on the left side here, you've got your elite mines and bookmarks page. So you can click on some of these. 
and then this bottom one will just take you to your expanded map view which you can go to world map from there so if we go back Um, the other things we can do is in here we can click on our mobility and you can use more mobility if you want. You can come into your resources and use more resources if you want. Um, and here is your coordinates. So you can type in a different coordinate if you want and zoom around the map. And here is your notification to let you know how far away from your home base you are. This is useful if you kind of get lost scouting for skitties, cities and you notice that you're a couple hundred away. That means that your fleet time is going to be very long. So you just click on that and we'll shoot back to our city. Right, I think that's about it for the interface. Uh, those are all the major options. So we'll go and deep dive into some of these options in other videos. All right, everybody, I think that's it for today. Be safe out there. And remember, this is a game, so have fun. And as always, the shameless plug at the end of the video, if you guys wouldn't mind liking the video, sharing it, subscribing, leaving a comment, whatever you can do to help me out. Hope you liked it, and I hope you learned something.